In 1936, Max Hahn and his wife Emma were hiking along Red Creek in London, Texas when they stumbled upon something unusual. Embedded in a rock, they found a wooden handle and a metal hammerhead, still in pristine condition. But what made this discovery so remarkable was the fact that the rock in which it was encased was over 400 million years old, according to geological analysis. The London Hammer has puzzled scientists and researchers ever since. How did a modern hammer end up encased in a 400 million year old rock before humans existed? One theory is that the hammer was simply dropped by a human, and over time, sediment and minerals encased it, preserving it in the rock. However, this theory has been debunked by many experts, who argue that the hammer could not have been encased in the rock over a long period of time because the surrounding rock is made of limestone, which does not preserve organic material well. Another theory is that the hammer belonged to an ancient civilization that existed millions of years ago. This theory is supported by the fact that the hammerhead is made of an iron composition that is not naturally occurring in the area. It is possible that the hammer was made by an advanced civilization that possessed knowledge of metallurgy and ironworking. Others have suggested that the hammer may be evidence of time travel, or that it is the work of extraterrestrial beings who visited Earth millions of years ago. Despite numerous attempts to explain the London hammer, it remains a mystery to this day. Some skeptics have suggested that the entire discovery was a hoax, and that the hammer was deliberately planted in the rock to fool people. The origin of the London hammer is still a subject of debate among scientists and researchers. While some argue that it may be evidence of an ancient civilization or an extraterrestrial visit, others believe it is simply a clever hoax. Regardless of its origin, the London Hammer is a fascinating artifact that has captured the imagination of people around the world and continues to be a topic of discussion and study.